100 Jams, where hit music lives. Locked in the midday chop up right here on this beautiful Thursday with your girl, Evan Green, Young Blue, Chris Brown, Baddest in the Mix, man. Right now, you know, it's all about Chat Trap, talking about what's happening in the media. And Chat Trap is brought to you by the Village Drug and Beauty Supply and Village Auto Parts. There's only one place you need to shop for your hair, skin, baby items, grocery, and the household. And it's at the Village Drug and Beauty Supply Store. Located at number 57 Alexandria Boulevard, Nassau Village. You can get 20% off the premium now at the Village Drugs and Beauty Supply Store. You can also call them at 393-3419 or WhatsApp at 441-3943. So let's talk about what's happening today. What has been hitting the headlines, all the juiciest topics. So briefly, I just want to say the fact that Lil Baby decided to say that he believes that he is the little Wayne of this generation. Do we all agree with that? I mean, he's pretty good. I don't I don't know. A lot of persons didn't like the fact that he's comparing himself to Lil Wayne. Or they don't like the fact that to see these young rappers compare themselves to someone else in the game. And it's like, I mean, it's quite a comparison because Lil Baby is right now at the top. And they are really pushing him. Seeing that he said, you know, he isn't interested in getting any tattoos. And right now he does seem to be leading the way for um, the younger generation and maybe he is Lil Wayne. Who knows? I don't know. But he's definitely good. But, hey, I just wouldn't put the two, you know, together. And also, Donnie Lay, she finally announced that she's pregnant by the baby. And everyone kind of already knew this. But, yeah, she finally announced it. And she also announced that she is having a baby girl with the baby. So, hey. Congratulations to the two right there. But moving on to more important news, Drake announced that his album Certified Lover Boy will definitely be released before the summer is over. And now Drake has custom made Air Forces to match, which should also be released at the same time. However, unfortunate news for Nike lovers, Nike could soon face a sneaker shortage if the COVID-19 pandemic continues. And I know a lot of people do not like hearing this, especially those ones who purchase the sneakers as soon as they drop. So the sneakers are manufactured in Vietnam, and just recently, coronavirus broke out in the country rapidly, which caused a sudden shutdown of Nike suppliers in Vietnam, and they were forced to halt production. So Nike imports from Vietnam accounted for 82% of the brand shipments in the last 12 months, ending June 30th. And it's sad to see that the potential sneaker shortage is right around the back-to-school season and could have a significant effect on Nike's usual sales during the season season oh boy because you know you're always getting the nike shoes to go back to school and it's like what are you gonna do if you know if they have a shortage i don't know what i'm gonna do but i'm just hoping uh that they don't have the shortage and the man in charge of directing friday's tokyo olympics opening ceremony has just been fired what is going on Friday is tomorrow. We all know it, but he's been fired hours before the start of the event. After it was discovered, he made a Holocaust joke in 1998. All I can say is be careful what you say, people, because trust me, it will haunt you years in the future. So in the old clip, um, he can reportedly be heard saying... Let's play the genocide of Jews. Oh, boy. One thing I can tell you, if you're trying to make it big in whatever industry, do not mention anything about the Jews. This will always get you in trouble. Of course, that's what happened to Nick Cannon. And finally, you know, he got his job back. He got wild and out back. But, hey, it took a lot. So I'm just saying, do not mention anything about the Jews. That's a lesson for today. But that's it for Chat Trap, talking about what's happening in the media Chat Trap was brought to you by the Village Drug and Beauty Supply and Village Auto Parts. And no fair, the Village Auto Parts is here. They have coaster bus parts, clutch disc, starters, alternators, tail lamps, brake rotors, American and Japanese vehicle parts. The Village Hardware Store, located at Alexandria Boulevard, Nassau Village. You can call them today and let the Village Auto Parts find that part for you. That's 601-4746, 601-4752, or WhatsApp 525-9159.